the day 10. We got raided, but none of us were wounded, etc. So that was as expected. Okay, so first thing first every day, what we're going to have to do is get these two chatting. Then I think we can get her to bed first. And then do, well, pick this up first. So everybody eats tomorrow. So everybody eats on day 11, 13, etc. We'll see if we can keep up with that. But to keep up with that, we're going to need the carrot machine in place. So otherwise, this is going to be exhausted. Um, but yeah, I think we've got plenty of time. I think we're good. So now they finish with their chat routine is that she will now go play on her two toys. And that should get rid of her sad status. We can make more toys as well if necessary. Um, we've got nothing else to do today apart from wait to see if we get any visitors. Except for he can make that bandage, so let's do that. Because Franco might be coming today. I'm tempted to make this given that we can get sicknesses. It's our bandage done. There's nothing else we can do here. Now, Kleena is happy, but we'll get her on her second toy anyway. So just looking at the carrot machine and what we need, it is wooden components. Not that many to get the first stage in, but then we need to upgrade it. And to upgrade it, we're going to need, I think it's eight of these in total. So I have to bring back a stack of these, which I think we've got at the decrepit squad. So 11.10, we've passed the 11 o'clock cutoff, so there is going to be no visitor today so what I'm going to do is switch these two over and I'll see you tonight. All right so we do have some new locations. We still have the decrepit squad. I was just looking at what was blocked out by fighting here. So we've got the city hospital but we can't get there. Uh, semi attached house can't get there. Small apartment building. So that's uh, three thugs in there, which is an easy takedown. We can get a lot of booze, we can get a lot of ammunition and guns from there. That's a good one. So this one's shut down, which is a shame because we had a lot of good stuff there. And the hotel, previously owned by, by some armed thugs. So that's um, a combat one as well. Supermarket, we're pretty much done with that. So decrepit squat, it is. Uh, Shelled school. Group of rebel militiamen, okay. All right, but tonight it's going to be the decrepit squad. So scavenge, guard, she sleeps, and uh, prepare, and go. And no running around needed. Just go to our centralized pile. So we need a stack of those. And I think the rest is just one, two, three, four, five, three, four. I'll just see where that leaves us and go. The day 11. So everybody eats today. So routine is that she, well, Actually, she needs to eat first, so let's do that. Let's get these two down for a chat. Because these two need to talk every day. All right, now we are going to give her two meals today so that she gets off of hungry. And then she never goes to very hungry status again. And then she'll eat every other odd day. So days 11, 13, 15, just like Roman. All right, so she can go to sleep. So have these guys finished already? They have. Okay, so Roman needs to eat, but so does Kalina, so we need to make some more food. Puts us down to six water, so we need to get our water production up. 
So Roman's finished with the food and Franco's here. So now Kalina needs to eat. So let's do that. And let's see what Franco's got. Okay, trade. So no tobacco leaves. But we'll take those. So we'll take this because we can make another bandage with it straight away. We'll take that. We'll take the water. The parts. So we can trade bullets if necessary because we can get more from various locations later. Let's use cigarettes for now. So that's the expensive ones, we don't want that. We don't necessarily need these, but we do want all of these and we do want all of those. Gun parts, no, just the wood. That's it, I think. Okay, deal there. So, Kalina isn't sad, but we'll keep her playing anyway. Roman needs to pick this up. So that's everybody's day 13 meal, so we're good there. But we need water production. So let's sort that out. If we can. Now we can get some water going. So we've got three of these. Let's do that. So later in the game I'll start teaching her to do stuff, but for now we just need to get it out of the way. Actually, let's get him to sleep and get her to finish that. Water done. So, carrot machine. So let's get it started anyway see where we are after this. So that's the base carrot machine in place. Now it's just a question of how much we need for the upgrades. So this is where we need eight of these guys because we have to build the lamp. So let's go do that. Now we've got the lamp. Let's just check on what we need next. So we're pretty close to being able to do this now. So five wood. So it's just um, two stacks there and uh, three stacks here and we can do this. But then to put carrots on, we're going to need 20 water. So once the um, water machine finishes delivering, then we're going to be on 14. So we need to get another stack on now and another one in the morning. And that will give us the 20 water that we need. And then we're going to need um, two meat, which we've got. All right, so we can do that tomorrow. Um, so nothing more to do today, except to get another one of these on before um, everybody goes to sleep. And I'll see you tonight. So we've still got a lot of stuff here, so we don't need to think about going anywhere else yet. Eventually, um, we'll probably do a takedown of the hotel. Yeah, so that'll be the next step. But meantime, we could just stick to this location because it's got everything we need, which is just wood and components. So let's do that. Sorry, she's scavenging. He's guarding and she's sleeping and no preparation needed and go. So at a bare minimum we needed two stacks of these, three stacks of these and the rest is a little bit optional. Now that's probably worth taking given that we do have a need for water and we're going to have a need for 20 water very soon. So that puts us over 20, so it's worth taking. I think we do get the port in this scenario, in which case we'll have to come back for the diamond, but not for now. 
So if we need to make more filters, we're going to need a couple more of those and a couple more of these for good luck. Sorry, I thought it was... 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, yep, yeah, that'll do. Okay, go. So day 12, and I think we're done now because we've got security maxed out. We're feeding everybody every two days, and we've got enough food to keep that going for a while. Um, nobody's ever going to get wounded. We're not going to lose anything. We've got plenty of bullets, and uh, we'll be able to go to the hotel, take out the guys there, and get a bunch more. So anyway, Amelia to sleep, so we just follow this routine every day. Get her up. So everybody eats every odd day. So these two just have their chat every day. So they're finished and uh, we can get Roman down here, get her playing, which will get rid of her sad status. So he should be able to upgrade this now, which he can. Now we can make carrots. So we've got our day 13 meal. This is good for our day 15 meal. So by day 17, we just need this to deliver. So we need a couple of these. So we're going to use the meat. All right, now we can get our carrots on. So note that it takes two of these and 20 water. So we're going to have to keep the uh, water machine going so that firstly we can cook food. Uh, but also have another 20 water at hand when we need to make a bunch more carrots. So this is going to deliver eight carrots in three days time. And this will keep delivering enough food that we can keep our um, meals going every odd day for all three of them. In fact, you can feed four that way. So that's our food production done. So we just have to feed this once or twice every day. That way we keep our water up. We've got our uh, security in place. So that's it. I think I'll end the series there because that's really the uh, end of the beginning, if you like. And from now on, it's just um, maintaining the house until we get another house guest. I don't know when that happens. Um, seeing out the crime spree, which is no problem with Roman guarding the house. Um, and seeing out the winter, which would be no problem either. Okay, so anyway, thanks for watching. And what I'll do is I'll keep the... I'll keep going until the epilogue and we'll just see um, what ending everybody got and I hope to see you then. So thanks for watching and bye.